one huge development that is happening here in Sevierville is the 407 Gateway to Adventure. And their first piece of that is the world's largest Bucky's, which is set to open um, at the end of June. So we're excited about that. It's going to be massive, 74,000 square feet, 250 foot long car wash, 120 gas pumps and EV charging stations. So it's definitely going to be a showstopper as far as Bucky's go. For Sevierville, we are drawing people in, you know, a lot from the Southeast, but also from all over the country. We've really seen in the last few years, um, increased visitation from the Midwest, from the West, from the Northwest. Um, some places that I'm just like, I'm blown away that people want to drive 20 something hours to get here and they are driving. We're mostly a drive destination. And, um, you know, it's great when you, you get here and you get to see people from all around the country. And as, as you mentioned earlier, from all around the world. We're originally founded in 1795. A lot of our buildings go back to the 1800s um, that are in that area. They've got some great architecture. We've done some wonderful interpretive history initiatives down there, um, telling Sevierville's story, both through uh, placards that kind of give you the, the whole background and also through art um, that really you know shares some unique stories about our area. And one of my favorite places in downtown is the Pines, which is a new entertainment venue. It has opened in the former Pines Theater, which is where Dolly Parton got her start and did her first paying gig at the age of 10. So that's a really cool place for Dolly fans to visit as well while they're in Sevierville. Uh, Dolly Parton is a huge part of Sevierville. Um, she's from Sevierville. And um, of course, we've found a lot of different ways to honor her. Everything from Dolly Parton Parkway, which is a major thoroughfare in town, to the Dolly Parton statue that's located in our downtown. But she just continues to give back. And people coming to Sevierville to enjoy both Dollywood, which is about five minutes from downtown, um, and also to see kind of where she grew up and experience some of those, those type of places, the venues, having the pines downtown and different murals that kind of honor her. Um, that's huge for us. You know, we want to continue to show her how much we love her because she continues to show her hometown what we mean to her and, and just giving back all the time.